Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody sent me this logo. It's a from a country club and want to know how to trace it. And first of all, for the person I'm doing it for, I made it really little. I'm going to go to bitmap and resample it. We don't have to do anything. It's already above three. I am not going to convert it to a bitmap. I'm just going to trace it the way it is. I'm going to use outline trace and clip art. That's what I use most of the time. It's already done it. Your normally your trace version will be on top and you can see it's a group of 19 objects. There are several ways you could do this and probably the easiest way, this thing is less than an inch. So we're going to set our nudge factor on one inch and we're just going to use a smart fill tool to fill that in and nudge it over and just nudge over, nudge over the parts. We don't have to do much to it. And at this time I would probably clean it up a little bit more, but it came out really good. And if we use the yellow box trick, you can see that there's no, uh, it's transparent. So there's nothing behind it. Uh, just depending on the size you're going to use this for, uh, if it, if you're going to grade this, like on a knife handle, like I think they were going to do, um, these thinner non lines might, might burn away. So I, my suggestion would be to use a low power and, and do it multiple passes. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit.